Welcome to Fresh Ideas. Today I'm here with Chef John Peters from Fresh and we're going to make Oysters Carbonara. Yes, it's a New Orleans dish that uh, I first learned to do when I was working in New Orleans and I did it at my restaurant uh, back home in Louisiana. Uh, what we're going to start here with is a hot skillet and we have some nice bacon, a little bit of garlic here. I've got some gold bell pepper here that I've done a little brunoise cut with. That's just a fine dice. We got a little Creole season we're going to add. Mm. We've got our bacon going well. Now, the next step we're going to do is we're going to get some of these nice Gulf oysters. Put about 12 in there with the artichoke hearts. We're going to hit it with a little bit of green onion. And here comes our sauce. This is a fresh Alfredo sauce. This has already got the cheese and everything in it. I measured off a nice amount of uh, pasta. We're going to drop it in our water. In the uh, restaurant world, we have our pastas, most of them already uh, cooked before we go into service and then we reheat in pasta water. And as you go through service, this pasta water here is one of your best friends to thicken sauces because it gets a lot of starch going in it. Yes, we use it is. lots of, uh -huh. of ladles of that to thicken different types of sauces. Well, and that's another good way to cut down on some fat in your sauces oh, too. Oh, sure, the yeah. pasta water, Most you get definitely. that good starchy flavor and it, Most definitely. it thickens it up for you. Last step we have here is our final aromatic, which is some uh, chiffonade, which is a fine uh, sliced uh, basil leaves. That's going to give it a really earthy flavor as well. It matches well with the oysters. Well, yeah. that looks great. I think we're just about we ready. We are ready. Yeah. Here's a plate for us. Got some good hot pasta here. Add this through. The pasta itself will thicken around the sauce. <laughs> oh, that's great. Don't burn my other hand while I'm doing it. <laughs> <laughs> I think we can roll with that. Oh, wonderful. Oh. That looks fantastic. Well, you can find this recipe in Wednesday's Tyler Morning Telegraph food section and also on CBS19.tv. Thanks, John, for joining me. This was a lot of fun. Thank you for having me. Thank you.